happy. This has been a big project for him, and I think he did a wonderful job. And, uh, I hope he's happy with it because he gets a cut out of this deal, and he's the one that said, let's go for it, and I agree with him. So, uh, so And I get to go home earlier, and I hear there's a snowstorm coming, so. <laughs> so not for you guys, but Michigan. <laughs> yeah, oh, I see. You're from Michigan. Oh. Yes, I'm from Detroit, Michigan area, so my husband just called me and said, you might want to get started as soon as you can, so. So, uh, so, right, uh, yes, so it was his decision? No, it was my decision. It's your decision. Yeah, mm -hmm. but because he's put all this work and effort, you know, you want to make sure that the person that's doing this work gets paid well. I mean, if you put this effort, wouldn't you like a good size paycheck for yourself? And but, all that. But don't you think all these Elvis fans and your dad's fans are ex unbelievably disappointed? I would bet they're, they're very disappointed, but I would hope that, that Paul's fans actually had many opportunities to come and visit and got the best gift they could, his presence, and uh, having many films and YouTubes available to his fans and stuff. Um, again, if you want a little bit of, there's the t-shirts that you mind. If you want me to sign a t-shirt, I would do that for you, no problem. It's not my dad's signature, but uh, I would be more than happy to sign any t-shirts for you. So, you know stuff. who bought it from them? No, I do not. Right. <laughs> I'd like to meet him, though. I might give up my uh, husband for a new husband, <laughs> if so, it happens to be a, a guy. <laughs> it, it, but any information, are they American or what? I'm not sure. I, do, I have not been told. And what was the final price? I think it was 50 something. I've uh, been busy talking to people, so I'm not quite sure how much it went for. And what was the, the lowest you would have accepted? I didn't have a mount. Yeah. I didn't have none. I just let you guys decide what was going to happen on this one. Yeah. So, thank you so, so much. So, overall, are you happy right now? I'm excited and nervous, still scared. I got all these emotions happening. <laughs> But I, I thank for everybody that uh, came out and uh, made this popular to the news and everything. So I want to thank everybody for that. And I truly mean that because without the advertising and stuff, I wouldn't have got this crowd and stuff. So thank you. So it's a short day for you. What are you going to do for the rest of the day? My husband says we have a snowstorm happening uh, that's coming tonight. So hopefully I'll get home before that. Oh, you're leaving right now? Uh, well, after I get to take care of stuff and all that. Plus, I'm waiting for a young man to show up. And I have this uh, one of the guitars that used to be taken a picture of as a lifetime member. You got an opportunity. And um, his name is Forrest uh, Ford. And I wanted to uh, present this to him. So I might be hanging around until he gets here. But if you don't know much about the buyer, but what do you... I mean, in a way, this might be good news because possibly it's someone that wants to keep it all together. What do you What do you hope happens with all this stuff? Well, I hope that they take care of it and um, treasure it, and hopefully, maybe they'll continue to show it to the Elvis fans. I'm not sure, as we know that the house has to be sold separate, so uh, there's going to have to be a bid on the house now because of issues with it right now. At this